Der er nu kun en uge til premieren på Nikolaj Arcells storfilm, en kongelig affære, der er baseret på det livsfarlige trekantsdrama mellem den sindssyge kong Christian den 7., hans livlæge Strunse og den unge dronning Karoline Mathilde. I den anledning mødte vi den kvindelige hovedrolleindhaver Alicia Vikander til en snak i kongens have i København. Her talte vi blandt andet med hende om hendes forhold til dramaet og hendes arbejde med rollen som Karoline Mathilde. I was familiar with this st- uh, your story, the Danish story, already when I got the part, because I read the Leave Lanes Besøg uh, about five years ago, and that was one of my favorite books, so I was thrilled when I first got the signs for my casting. I think Nikolai did a great job of actually creating a film that both had a great love story, but still has this political drama in it. And just the fact that it's a tri- triangle drama, but it's not like someone leaves one for another. It actually, when they're the most happy in the film, is actually when they all create this triangle together, and they all kind of depend and needs each other, and they almost become this little family. What we did and what we decided from the beginning was to actually undress the costume drama in a way and try not to. I mean, I didn't think so much about how it was living in the 17th century or the 18th century. I was trying to relate to how I as a young woman today try to fit in uh, into my missions and how to be a woman in our time. Den unge svenske skuespiller Ine blev uddannet fra den svenske balletskole i Stockholm i 2007, men medvirkede derefter i flere tv-produktioner, serier og kortfilm og havde sin debut i en svensk spillefilm i 2010. Vi måtte derfor høre hende, hvordan det var pludselig at arbejde på en stor film med en stjerneskuespiller som Mads Mikkelsen. It was a big thing meeting him the first time when I actually came here to Denmark and did my last casting and um, but I mean it took five minutes and I was totally relaxed in his company because he's just so down to earth and simple and he's a brilliant actor so I got a lot of inspiration and yeah it's so a nice shoot. We were like a little family and we worked six days a week for like 14 hours a day but we all always came back to the hotel and we just I don't know goofed around and we had poker nights and we uh, played football and pool and bobbling I don't, I don't know what we did but it was yeah we became very good friends all of us it's a good thing is otherwise you're so you know into your work and then it's so professional of course and very intense and yeah so it's good to have that as a the other side of it. Yeah.